waking up and unzipping the door of the tent only to look around and find that we were camping on a partially frozen lake. Happy Saturday everyone, welcome to Story Saturday, and today I thought I would share with you guys the story about the time in the Boy Scouts where we went winter camping and we set up our tents on a partially frozen lake. So like I told you guys many times before, when I was younger, I was in the Cub Scouts and the Boy Scouts, and one of the things that you needed to do for the camping merit badge was actually go out and camp in the winter inside of a tent. And you had to complete this for a certain number of dates, you know, overnight camping. Now, I don't know if it's the same way now because they have changed the merit badges a lot since I was in the Scouts, but nonetheless, we had gone up to the typical camping area in our area that we went every single time we went camping with the troop. Anyways, we had driven up to the campground. It was a snowy Friday night. We had rented a cabin for like the younger people that were in the troop that weren't actually participating or doing the requirements to get the merit badge so they you know went inside and set up and everything like that and we had to choose a spot I forget it was like 300 feet or so away from the cabin you couldn't set up the tents right next to the cabin anything like that and also we wanted to have a fire so what we did was actually walk down towards where the lake was and at this point in time it appeared that the lake was frozen so myself and a couple of my buddies decided that it would be a good idea to set the tents up there so we had our dinner that night we played flashlight tag or manhunt something like that and then we went to bed in the tent but after about an hour and an hour and a half of sleeping the floor was just extremely wet there was a little bit of water appearing on it so we just figured the snow was melting underneath and it was just permeating up through the bottom of the tent nonetheless we slept through the night and when we opened the tent door the following morning we looked out and I'd say a good hundred or so feet in front of us was just open water on the lake I'm not too entirely sure of how thick the ice was where we actually had the tent set up but I had shared a story with you guys before about actually falling into a stream that was kind of near where this spot was that we camped on the ice but nonetheless that is just my story about sleeping in a tent on a partially frozen lake nothing bad happened we didn't fall into the water or anything like that if you guys enjoyed this story let me know by giving a thumbs up comment down below let me know if you have ever done anything like that and I will see everybody on Monday for Film and Television Monday. Peace.